Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Kini Talks. If you're new to the channel, please subscribe and click on the bell icon. I post cool videos all the time. In this episode, we are going to unbox the AKG Lyra. AKG is a company owned by Herman, which is owned by Samsung, and it's manufactured in China. A lot of microphones are only microphones I know that are manufactured in India are Ahuja, and Ahuja currently doesn't make something similar to this one. So yeah, it's a global world, right? A lot of people have been talking about this microphone because it's quite interesting. A lot of features, a lot of new things included in the microphone. So let's go ahead with the unboxing, and I'll explain some more. All right, so I got the seal off, and as soon as we open the microphone, we get some paperwork. So congratulations, you got a new microphone. Some tips and tricks about it. You get some more instructions. You get a warranty card, and you also get, you know, uh. Paper, some paperwork regarding Ableton Live. So, you know, you can use this along with your new microphone. You get a lot of foam packaging. So, this is how it looks in the box. Really solid, doesn't shake at all. Now, the box is huge. It's not a small box. And the microphone as well looks big. Now, as soon as you pull it out of the box, it's like this big pack of foam. Let's keep it on the side here and pull up one side. So this is how it comes in. You get a small adapter for your boom mounts, etc., which is very important. Keep it safe. You get a USB-C to USB-A cable. So. You know you can connect it to your computers but the sad thing is i expected a usb-c to usb-c cable like if you're making usb-c go for it all the way but oh well let's keep that aside going ahead let's have a look at the microphone it is solid and heavy let's get the packaging out right. and this is how it looks the mount is made of aluminium so it's solid really heavy and it's got a good grip on the bottom it's nice soft pad over here and it's a big microphone now it's not small for sure it's really of a good size now let's take a look around the microphone as we can see, AKG is written over here. So I feel this must be the front side where you have the mute button. Feels okay. Not that great as a button on an iPhone or an iPad, but not bad. It has a good click to it. This over here is the volume control for your studio monitor headphones. You can actually plug in a headphone over here to monitor your audio right away. And this is the volume control. You do have the capture modes over here, but don't get mistaken, it's not the knob for the capture uh, modes. The knob for the capture modes is on the opposite side, which is labeled as microphone pattern. And you definitely have a good click to it. It's not bad, feels solid. Yep. The bottom knob here is microphone gain. So that's one cool feature of this microphone. You can actually adjust the gain right from the source. Apart from that, let's have a look at the connectivity ports. As I had explained, you can connect a studio monitor headphone over here. You can also connect the USB-C cable over here. Example, this one goes over here and the other end goes to your computer. You can also use a USB-C to USB-C cable in case you're connecting this to your MacBook or any other uh, USB-C device like an iPad. And um, that's kind of it. Construction is solid. The base is really good. The housing on the other hand is plastic. So you need to be a little careful there. The cage over here kind of feels like metal. And you can actually see the 
microphones inside if you angle it right in the light cool stuff now the sad bit is you don't get a carrying case with the microphone however the foam packaging that comes with the microphone is really good i would recommend everyone keep it and don't let go of it so that in case you need to you know carry it around you can use that this is not something that i would recommend just to you know throw it in your bag and you know carry around because the knobs may break the knobs are not that strong it's soft it feels soft and has a little bit of play to it but yeah take care of your microphone that's all for this unboxing i'll be posting a few more videos regarding the audio quality how it sounds with the different capture modes and i'll also be connecting it to the latest ipad air which has USB C, just to check if you can use this as an external microphone when recording video as well so links will be updated in the description uh, have a nice day guys if you like the video give it a thumbs up if you did not like this video give it a thumbs down twice and stay safe thank you so much see you again in the next video